this it? Yep. It's a pretty home. Thank you. Um, are you going to knock, or...? I, I don't think I'm ready. What? Of course you're ready. You've wanted to do this for so long, and, and this is your only desire. This is all you wanted to do when we came here, and now is your chance. I know, I know, I just... What if they're not home? That's my worst fear. Well, try and push that thought aside. Think of the good things that could happen when you open that door. Look, I'm trying, okay? It, it's not that easy. Then do it for me. Is this your mom? Not really. So, who are you? The psychotic witch that turned me into a beast. Oh, come on now, don't overreact. Uh, me? Overreacting? You turned me into a wolf for seven years. Oh, get over it, Brent. Those seven years have passed, and look at you now. You're human. But do you have any idea what it was like to be an animal in the woods where not even one person just stopped to feel bad for you or even try to take care of you? I was alone for seven years until Misty came along. And I'm assuming that's who this is? Um, yeah. Are you two in love or something? Uh, um, no. Then how did the spell break? <laughs> well, technically, she did say she loved me. But she probably just said that because I was a good companion. That doesn't make any sense. Alright, first of all, why are you in my house? And where are my parents? You seriously don't know. I bought the house a couple years ago, actually. But where are my parents? All I know is that they are not here, okay? Even I don't know. I just bought the house to protect it. I don't believe you. Believe what you want, but I'm telling the truth. Um, if you want, we can get Evan to try using a truth spell on her. Only if necessary. That won't be necessary. Evan who? What, do you know him? I knew an Evan. He was also a witch. Was he a psycho who killed innocent villages with his dad? You know, he did mention a thing or two about that. Well, he's my brother. And how do you know him? Oh, well, Evan and I go way back. He said he needed a place to hide, and I told him he could stay with me. And the rest is a secret. Wouldn't want the little sister to hear. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't want to know. Since you don't have any information that can help us, we will be leaving now. Why so soon? <sighs> we have somewhere to be. I will most likely not be coming back here, and this is the last you will see of me. Before you go, I'd like to give you something. What's this? It's a potion of protection. Whenever you need to feel a little more safe, use this. The book has spells that I've been waiting to show to Evan, but he fled before I could even say a word. Thank you, I think. I hope you find your parents, and you, 
I hope you're in good hands with Evan. He's got a dark side that you don't want to see. He's a changed man, and I have hope in him. Watch your words. He hates the word hope. Tell me about it. Misty, I think we should leave now. Right. Well, I guess it was nice meeting you. Blaze. Call me Blaze. Well, Blaze, take care of yourself. You too, dear. Why didn't you let me see him? Because he's not ready to see you. Not yet. Good morning, love. Good morning, Klaus. Um, I'd like to talk to you. I'm all ears. We're leaving today, and we aren't coming back. I just... If you want to tell me something, tell me now, because you will most likely not get a chance to say it. Why do you say that? Well, you don't want to come home with us. Well, I do respect your choice, but that also means we will never see each other again. I haven't made my choice yet. It's obvious, Klaus. Yes, I could stand here and try to convince you to come with us, but you obviously don't want to. So, I'm letting you go. Is that how you feel? No! Of course not! I want you to come home with us, and I really do, but I'm not gonna beg you to come because you obviously already made your choice and it's your life. I, I can't force you. I'm not saying any last words because there are no last words. I will see you again, I promise. Will you though? Yes, that's my promise to you. Uh, can you just... Think about it. I don't know, Misty. Please, Klaus. I can't give you my word. I don't need your word to know you'll do it. I'll see you in a bit. So, are we ready? Where's Brent? Is that Brent? Yes, alright, alright, I know. Now I don't look like a homeless man. <laughs> you look... Handsome? Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that. Alright, let's board the ship. Wait! You're coming? What about your life here? It can live without me for a little while. Plus I have problems I need to fix. Like you said, one being my father. Well, welcome back. <laughs> 